Hi, everybody. Hi, Nancy, Cynthia, Judith. Hope you're well. So, Rhino Ready. Like, I've had this for a while. It's an online exclusive. Exclusive. I can't even speak. I just woke up from a nap a little while ago. Yeah, so there's a couple. I didn't use that on the birthday card. I forgot. But anyway, it's really fun. You can make these different trees, but I didn't use any of them on the cards either. But fun. All right. So we'll get going. Hey, Penny and Carol. So what else did I use? You know, there's always something. Deckled circles. So sincere. Deckled rectangles. Uh, nested essentials. I used that one. And heartfelt hexagon. What did I use in this? Oh, I hope your day is filled with joy. Okay, put those on the floor. This one can go over here. Now, mostly the paper I used was delightful floral. So pretty. I, I did not get this set, and I really wanted it. So I've got all this paper to use up. It's really pretty. Really pretty. I have a lot of paper to use up. <laughs> Just saying. Okay. Let me get situated here. So, card number one. I see more people jumped in. Uh, Linda. Robbie, Carol, Jennifer, Margaret, uh, boop, 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 and Penny, and Betty. I already said Penny. I read Betty and said Penny. Very strange. Okay. <laughs> uh, so, card number one. And there I cut out the flowers. And I wanted to show you something a little different. Oh, and I decided to pop these up a little bit. So, on smoky slate paper, and all I'm going to do with this, just to give it a little shading and a little something-something, SU-900, and it looks like it's not going to do anything, but it does turn a little little bit and we'll do instead of doing them dark we'll do them little toenails all right so the light smoky slate i'm just going to go around here a little bit A little bit where they give you the shading and where they don't. A little bit under the eyes. We'll go a little bit around here. And then... So it, it's already very light. But I just want to blend in, like, around the side so it doesn't just look like I put a line there. So it's just a little bit of shading. Let me do a little bit around his face there. So right on the smoky slate paper, you can do that. Okay. I think I did a little bit more on the other one. Okay, glue. Glue. Glue, glue. Got it.
should have did these. I didn't do any of them in advance. Up. Up Periscope. to cover up that this pretty paper but that's why they make two sides though and a little bit there Now, sometimes I cut out um, cardstock underneath these, but I didn't this time. And then this one, uh -oh. I don't want the little ones, I want a big one. I used up the other one I had. Oh no, I got another one. Let's see if that's enough. Yeah, that will be enough. And I am going to make him a little darker. He looks naked. So I'm going to grab the dark. Whoa, that side's no good. Ooh, that's too dark. Oh, we'll fix it. I think I might have used the um, gray granite for the shading. My bad. We're going to fix it, though. Yeah, I can go back later and do a little more. Will I? Probably not. <laughs> Just saying. Yeah, that looks better. All right, all right, maybe at the very end. Okay, then we're going to put one there, because I got two others to color. And I think that's all I did. Maybe I'll put one there, too. There. And hope you're feeling better. And it's hiding. There it is. And I did that in Pretty Peacock. And when I can, I really like to ah, stamp crooked. So we're going to fix that. Let's see. I stamped two for this one. So we're going to stamp it on there. So when I can, oh, and I did the wrong one anyway. Duh. That's not what I wanted to stamp on there. So now that's not going to fit. Maybe it will. All right, we'll do something. Uh, do, 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 do. 
I think I'm still asleep, you guys. Don't laugh. Oh, not what I wanted to do. All right, let's see what. <laughs> oh, gotta love it. All right. Could be that one. Maybe the little one will fit. I kind of doubt it. Let's see. Let's see. Uh, nah. So I got to do the bigger one. All right. Be right back. Quick as a bunny. Definitely not what I wanted. I can't believe I did that. Oh, that's going to have to kind of, well, it, does, it, it fits. Kind of goes over part of the leaf, but it's all right. We'll, we'll just go with it because it's got no choice, do we? Ugh. Ugh. Now, probably the other circle, I don't know. Or I could have hand cut it. But, ta-da! Not exactly what, this is what it's really supposed to look like. Because I like stamping flat when I can. But this time. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. All right, let's put that one aside. Let's go for number two. Hmm. Okay, card number two. Let's put this in there and get it out of the way. Oh, yeah, Thanksgiving. All right. So. Again, we're going to use the SU-900. And I'm going to bring in a little bit of ivory. Give it a little bit of shading right in there. Then the smoky slate. So let's go with the dark first. And then underneath here, underneath there. under the tail, some on the back. Okay, then come back with the light. And this is why I liked when they sold them separately, because you end up using so much more of the light. So if you're watching me stamping up, 
Sell them separately again. Would you, huh, please? Huh? Quick, please. You can even sell better ones that with refills. <laughs> Go partners with Copic. Nah, they'd be really expensive then. Just want to even some of that out. And then you can leave like some light in the center a little bit. Well, eh, I'll do it with the with the other thing. All right, then I'm gonna. Oops, I forgot his ears. I'm gonna come back with the dark to do his tail. Otherwise, it won't really show up. A little bit in his ear. Uh, boop, 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 where is it? So I'm going to take the dark um, gray granite. So they're a little different, but close. Azure. So I'm just like doing a couple little dots in there with the dark. Don't try to like color too much, like in small spots. And then, oh, I grabbed Mango Melody, which is retired, but whatever yellowish color you got. Okay, so then if you wanted to make I'll probably ruin it now, but if you wanted to make some lighter area, like around his belly, you just take your color lifter. Uh, oh, we could give this one a little bit of... A little bit of cheek. Just a little. No, not that. Just blend it in a little bit. I. There's those two. There's a lot of gluing on this one. And that. It's going to give him a little dimension. All right, we can put this on there. Okay, so so 
So I'm just tapping the top. And cleaning this up a little bit. Good, good, good. So he's going to go over there. I'm going to put this on right now. And I am going to color in just a little bit. And this is with the parakeet party. All right, then we start this. So I just kind of layered them up. All right, so I'm going to start there because I want that to be on top. Whoa. Whoa. And I got plenty of these extra. Let me do a dark one since I have the light ones there. Okay. And I've got these little leaves. So I'm going to put them right in the corner. See, I got something stamped in advance. Only because I really didn't love what I did there. So then I like that better. But I couldn't change it. I couldn't fit it over that one. So that's going to go right there. And I think I might pop it up. And this guy I don't have to pop up because I gave him some dimension with all the extra pieces underneath them. Come back. Yeah, maybe I won't pop it up. It's a great day. And maybe... I'll add one more of those over there. So there is card number two. And they cute. And they just adorable.
Oh, I didn't put any. Uh, eh, we'll skip them for tonight. I didn't put any doodads. Doodad, doodad. Okay, card number three. Get done with the inside. Let's stamp this one. <clears throat> So this could be a birthday or anything. It could be an anything. Let me get these two ready. Okay, I okay, may as well get this ready. Yes, and punch that piece out of there. Save paper. And I can get this ready. Oh, you know what I didn't do on the other one? I didn't color underneath them. that all we actually have to do is color it, put it on there. <gasps> Look, it's a ghost. Okay, so again, we're going to do the SU-900. Little bit of the ivory. And then, since it's in my hand, And this time we're using the gray granite. So same thing. Pick where you want it darker. If you know how to do the sun thing, go for it. Me, I just kind of do where I think it would be. That side never works. And I think this, oh, no, this is pretty good. Squeak, squeak. And just color all over. Blend in where you can. Forgot to do in here.
Yep, this one's drying out too. I guess I use my blends a lot, don't I? Let's take the light. So there is, no it's not, we got to put it on that. Got to make sure I wasn't backwards. Hey, Cindy. Marlene. Kathy. Yeah, these are cute. Cute little guys. Okay, so you could put a few things inside. Dress it up a little. Oh, I'm going to be really early tonight, aren't I? Okay. Nope. I was just going to cover this up, but... I'm going to need it on this. So where's that little round one I had? Mm -hmm. Let's get out all the goodies. So now this paper, and I'm going to do this one a little different. Because I remembered I have the gold celebrations. But if you turn it over, silver. They say nothing about that. They really don't. But I want to get this stamped, and there should be another circle. So now this is the one that was the happy birthday. Ta-da! It's hard to mess up in a circle. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, so that's ready. So what I figured to do with this, and this is the, um, whatchamacallit, the Suttles paper. So I figured, oh, I could go and put dots so you wouldn't have to see it. You might not see it anyway. Did I test it? No. But you might not see it from the clear because this dries clear. But this gives you so I'm gonna put that right there. Oh, don't slide on me. Well, of course, because I'm plastic. Okay, then the other piece, 
which now do I have to make it bigger? No, I don't, because these are going to go right here. And then it gets covered up with that. So it's all good. All good. Sometimes you work something out in your head and then you don't know if your head was right or not. And these, if you want, I didn't go all the way, like you can, you know, bend them a little bit. Okay, and then from Zoo Crew paper, I cut those out. I'm going to take the Light Smoky Slate. And just color that in his tail. I'm not worrying about any shading. No. All right. That one didn't get anything. That one did. So those, I'm going to put it on the card base. And I'm missing a white. All right, Dad, don't touch them. This piece goes on, and it's just the opposite side of that paper. Like that. Okay, so this is going to get One there. And what you do? Nothing. Thinking I should shut that ink pad. <laughs> oh, yeah, his little hat. So I'm going to put just a little bit on his hat. And then this is going to hold it in a little more. And this is where I could have stamped the horn, but forgot. So I'm not gluing down the hat. Whoa. So that's why I wanted it a little bit more protected. 
in there. And then this guy. And then I forgot to do this on the other one, but I'm going to do it on this one, just with a little bit of gray. So now they're not flying. Looks like he pished. So this is with the sheet, and that's without. So, yeah, I like it. It was just like a boom afterthought. So let me bring them back. Quick night, huh? I thought with the coloring it was going to be a little bit longer to be with you guys. That one, and... That one. And let me put this. So all the, the measurements are in the description. If you want this set, it's an online exclusive. Yay! I think he's adorable. Remember, you can do it, you know, in other colors, not just the, the gray granite. But they're an easy color. And then you can mix them if you still have that paper or you could still get it. Fun, fun. All right, guys. Thanks for being here with me tonight. And for sure, it should be um, Paper Pumpkin next Sunday because I know it's been sent out. So I should have it. And I will see you next week, I hope, with Paper Pumpkin. Love you guys. Good night. Have a great week.